If you're jumping into Outlook and you'll find that it doesn't actually have a direct mail merge option. However, it does have some other tools, part of the Microsoft umbrella that you can use to do a mail merge. Today, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it. So without further ado, let's climb in. All right, so we're in Outlook and this is definitely not an option that you can do with just Outlook, right? So what we need to do is we're going into Microsoft Excel right over here. What you are going to do is initially you will create a CSV file with um, headings. Make sure that it does have headings. And here you'll see there's email addresses, there's names. You can also add job occupation, location, whatever additional information you'd like to add in here. You're going to go up to file here. You're going to go to export and you're going to say download as csv okay so you're going to have a csv file on your device we're going to jump over now to microsoft word okay so in microsoft word you're actually going to go ahead and um, this you will need the downloaded pc version okay so you'll need the app you can't do this with your browser version so this is the interface you'll look for mailings you're going to look for start mail merge and then you are going to click on email messages. We're going to go ahead and we're going to type our message out. We're going to click on select recipients and here we're going to click on use existing list. And what will happen is you'll have the opportunity to download the CSV file that you saved to this word document as your recipient list. All right, so this is where it becomes interesting. You're going to go ahead and put your cursor just past the greeting of your email. So right here at the top, you're going to hit the space button and you're going to go up to the right hand side. It'll say insert merge field. And here you are going to click on first name, right? So this will be correspondent to the headings that was on your CSV file. So this will now be personalized. On the top right hand side, you can now click on finish and merge and click on send email messages. This pop up window will appear and you can see it says message options. And the recipient over here is the email list that you created, which was the CSV file. And then you're going to enter an optional subject line and click on OK. And you've now successfully done an email merge in Microsoft Outlook. 